is going on you guys welcome to today's video we find ourselves in a very similar predicament I was in last time I tried to do this it's currently Monday morning um, I went to Delaware this week with my buddy Tony just a quick up and back kind of trip somehow on Friday I checked the junkyard website every single day but somehow I still miss things but apparently Friday of last week they put out a mark 4 Jetta on the two-piece BBS arch two wheels more than likely they're gone. But here we are on Monday morning, same as like last time. I'm two days late to the party. It's been the weekend. They're probably gone, but I gotta hold out some sort of hope. Got my BBS shirt on. We're gonna go try today and get some BBS RH2s off this Mark IV. They're not like a crazy spec wheel. It's an OEM wheel for the Mark IVs, but it's still a two-piece, 16-inch wheel. It's very cool. It looks good on Mark IIs. A nice OEM plus wheel for Mark IIs. More than likely they're gone but there's a, a small chance they're still there and I gotta at least check. So fingers crossed we get some BBS wheels today or if I don't get those, something else cool is there. If not, you'll probably not see this video at all. So if you're seeing this video right now, I must have found or did something, um, but if you didn't see this video, well then you, you didn't see this video and then we never had this conversation, but wish me luck. The weather is also um, terrible as you can see. So I'm really hoping, uh, <laughs> I'm hoping this is worth it. All right, we are back out here once again. It's definitely raining on me currently, but I have high hopes. We're gonna find something good today. All right, so from where I'm standing right now, I just saw the trunk of the Mark IV. It's the last, well, third from the last car in this right here. We'll just walk together. I couldn't tell if the wheels were there. Really hoping they are. It'd be nice, but I am, I am late to the party, so. Can't be mad if they're gone. I mean, I can still be mad, but like, they could still be here, I hope. Got a little Audi right here. I can see the trunk, I still can't see the wheels. Please be there, please be there, please be there. Oh, are they actually here? No way, no way. One, two, oh, am I actually in the house right now? Is it actually gonna work for me? Three, and four they're here and actually a lot of times these wheels the lips get destroyed and mangled this set looks to be in really good shape like this one has no curb rash which is mind-blowing for these wheels normally they're always like wrecked this one has a little bit of peeling on the lip but i don't see any curb rash in that one let's check them all i'm so excited they're actually here the thing this one no curbage one more Dude, there's not a messed up lip. This is amazing. This never happens to me. I'm three days late to the party and they're still here. Also, it's definitely raining on me, but hey, they're here. Let's go. And this is also a Uni Black Mark IV, but the hood's trash. I looked at it. Anything else in this car that I might need? A little custom door cards there. Oh, I don't even care. Nothing matters. They're here, which is sick. Let's go. Me and this Jetta might be best friends because the um the rain is definitely here. But aside from that, we're still getting some two-piece BBS wheels from the junkyard, and I'm hyped. Again, they're not like a crazy spec wheel. I think they're 16 by six and a half or seven. Um, but still, BBS RX2s, two-piece wheels. They look very nice. Again, on a Mark One, Mark Two, or a Mark Three. Um just a nice OEM plus wheel and I'm hyped they're actually still here while I'm in the car anything I need it's got the newer center console um, they did some custom door cards on it yeah there's not much in here for me but again the wheels we're snagging the wheels
Yep. In my defense, it wasn't supposed to rain until like 2, 3 p.m. today. It's only 10 o'clock right now and it's downpouring. I did leave this morning and it was sprinkling. I, I saw it coming, but I didn't want to wait like all day long to come out here because if I did, the wheels would probably be gone. And the fact that they're still here, I'm still mind blown they're not gone. So I'm hyped they're here, but the rain, uh, rain kind of sucks right now. All right, so while I'm sitting here waiting for this rain to leave me alone, I was talking to Dimitri, Mr. Retro Wheels himself, about these wheels. Um, he said they're called the RS 771s. Now I've seen that name before. I've always called these wheels the RX 2s, which is what a lot of people call them. If you look them up online as well, you can see tons of photos where they're just called the RX 2. But you can also search BBS RS 771 and it's the same wheel. He said there is a seven and a half or a seven wide option and a six and a half option. I believe these are the six and a half. So we'll see once I pull them off. But yeah, these wheels are either called, I've been saying the RX 2. Um, but I guess the official proper name is the BBS RS 771. People use both. I'm not entirely sure which one is like the correct name, but Dimitri is Mr. Wheels himself. So if he says they're called the RS 771, then that is what they are called. Maybe they just got nicknamed RX2 for whatever reason. Um, but no, BBS RS 771, what they are. So the rain has mostly chilled out. Walked back and got me this big old cart here. Let's get some BBS's boys. Hear me out. Instead of the BBS's, we buy some 22's and we make the wagon into a big old, big old donk. I always make jokes, but one day I will have a donk. Promise you. All right, I got our impact ready to go. I didn't charge it, but it still should be enough. On uh, this junk car, they actually take out all the lugs but one, so we should be fine. I had a breaker bar, it's fine. Always gotta bring multiple options just in case. There we go. Easy. Give me my BBS, please. Voila. There she is. Like I said, this thing is in like beautiful shape. Can't believe it. Normally the clear coat's all completely failed. The faces are all mashed up. There's some sort of, it's hit a curb somewhere, but these are in fantastic shape. Let's see the back actually, if it has an actual name. Here there, BBS RS771. And these ones are six and a half, right? Yeah, right there. 16 by six and a half ET42. Again, this is a two piece wheel. Just OEM, very, very cool. Show you guys a little trick here that you may or may not already know but on the front of the car there's no e-brake to hold this and i'm by myself so i don't press the brake this isn't doing enough but i have my breaker bar which you can do is spin it one way and go back the other way and usually you can get it like that and break it free that way if you're by yourself you can still make it happen voila another one down Where you at? There you are. And I want to go this this way. Yeah, okay, so we're going. There it is. Never fails. Okay. Voila. Full set. Let's go. Officially got the full set off the Jetta. Not a bad score for Monday morning. They said I was sad when I missed the last set of the two-piece BBSs off the BMW, but this will do. So the plan now, we'll do one more lap of the entire yard, see if there's anything that's not listed online or I missed, and if not, we'll head out of here. Hey, look at this. If you've been on the channel for a while, you remember I had one of these. Same color, same wheels, 2.5. Probably the exact same spec, honestly. Nope, we had black and tear and the manual, but for the most part, very, very similar spec to this one. Definitely missed that car, but seeing this one reminded me, eventually I'll own another Mark V. Just found this in the trunk, which is pretty cool. This is the front plate frame for the Mark IVs. If you had to run a front front plate, 
but I'm pretty sure it's completely brand new. Still in the original bag, looks like, which is pretty cool. Which means on the front of this car, there should be no screw holes in the um, the rub strip. Can we confirm? We can confirm. This is what you would want. So to have this car and never drill holes in the rub strip, like my Mark IV bumper, my original one, has two holes down here and some up here as well. But this one's completely hole free, which is dope. Found me another set of AMG wheels and also on this car. You're tuning the homies over there so this must have been some enthusiast car and now uh that's a little bit dead all right the rain's starting to come back so we're gonna go ahead and dip out of here but still so hyped on this score also this is gonna be quite the heavy car because the car itself is super heavy drag this thing Whoo! come on jeffrey well, let's go oh yeah she got some weight to her and just like that the package has been secured. These wheels are in need of a desert bath. Also didn't mention three of the four tires, well actually all four tires, the tread wise is brand new. This one Maybe the forklift hit it and put a big old hole inside, which sucks. But these three are all from 23 and 22, like brand new tire, which is cool. Just missing one, sadly. But looks like a forklift hit that one. So good, though. The wheels themselves are, are in mint condition. still surprised at how good condition these wheels are in i said every time i see these wheels on a mark four usually the lips are trash there's curb ash everywhere the face are falling apart but these ones are still in really good shape they could use it i mean you can go through and strip the lips to actually polish them because it still has a factory clear on it but polish those redo the faces to make them look like completely perfect but for just out of the junk yard not a bad set also you can see this is the 56 millimeter cap same as like those bbs's but i have some spare red caps which they won't stay in here but i just want to see how it looks got to line up bbs bbs to your valve stem line it all up Woo! the red caps are spicy these are fine they're oem but like Put some BBS caps on them, now we're talking. All right, so something I just noticed about these wheels that I didn't quite notice before, they all have the exact same part number, everything's the same size, 16 by six and a half, all same offset of 42, but two of the faces have a different stamping and I'm pretty sure it's the year. So these two, this one and this one, both have 01 right there and right there. This one has 02 and this one has 04. Now the car just came off with a 2002 Volkswagen Jetta, so I'm assuming these three all being 2002 and down were original and at some point maybe they had one swap because you wouldn't have an 04 face on an 02 reduction car this would have been from a newer one so maybe they had an accident they wrecked when they had to replace one at some point if that's what these are for but i'm assuming that this is production date so 2001 2001 2002 and 04. at first i thought the 01 might have been for a different like phase maybe a different offset different size maybe these two are 16 by six and a half and these ones are different but each one has the exact same part number they're all the same size all set offset everything is exactly the same i just think this is the uh production date okay well interesting turn of events we've got the bbs chilling on the corner here this is actually kind of turning into a bbs household we have the zombers we have the power techs obviously the ozs but majority of my wheels now are bbs we have the bbs rs 771s the rc 041s and the mark ii we have the lms the mark IV, and currently my rcs the um h and h ones the rc 336s christina has right now in a mark IV because they're getting painted and they're being used as rollers but we have four sets of bbs's now compared to all the other ones which is pretty cool but back to my original point i just had these loaded in a friend of mine down in south florida who just bought a very nice tornado red vr6 mark III building for wheels he just hit me up today and said hey 
do you have anything? And I actually, I have something. So I sent him a picture of this and uh, these might be leaving as soon as they just got here. So got a chance to at least save them from the junkyard from being crushed. But again, they might be leaving just as soon as they got here. So with that, gonna end this video here. Hope you guys enjoyed. Do not forget to be thankful for our school day. See you guys next time. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.